I'm camera shy. <laughs> My name is Gemma Wallenschlager. I'm on the US Para national team and I go in the mixed double. I was born in England and I grew up in South Africa. And then we moved to the States and I lived in Maryland, in Annapolis. And now my parents moved to Florida. And I live in Philly for school. I tried every sport before rowing. I went through basketball, soccer, volleyball, tennis, swimming, field hockey, lacrosse, you, you name it, I probably did it. I was born with a left club foot, um, so I have basically a fixed ankle in a way. My ankle doesn't move. My leg size is different. My shoe size is different. I don't run. I can't jump. It really affects everything, honestly. But I love it. I've learned to love it. When I was younger, I like tried to ignore my disability in a way and just tried to be like a normal kid. And then it caught up to me. And then I took up Netflix and decided that sports wasn't for me. Tried out rowing after. Then here I am. <laughs> Just having a little snack break. <laughs> right, feel how on the recovery. Where were we? My dad's always been in the whole restaurant world, so I've always grown up around food, which is why I'm a food connoisseur. <laughs> My favorite food, topping-wise, would have to be Nutella. I have Nutella every day for breakfast. I love a good chicken, roast chicken, delicious. My favorite boat snacks to bring out on the water would be Welch's fruit snacks, an applesauce of some kind. Right now, I'm in my go-go squeeze phase. And I love the Trader Joe's like apple and strawberry or apple and mango like fruit squeeze. Something that's like easy and you just like get it down the hatch. This is my first time on the national team, which is super exciting to be able to train at the highest level. As like someone with a disability, I thought I would never get like this was never an option. So it's super cool to be here and to be around people who are the top athletes. To just be in this environment is really motivating and inspiring. I'm really looking forward to travel. I love traveling. We're going to Paris next week. Um, we're going to Serbia at the end of the summer and then hopefully Paris next summer would be awesome. I'm really just looking forward to get out there and to just like do our thing on the water. My piece of advice to anyone that may also have a disability or has anything that could be holding them back is to just like keep going, keep your head up, keep going. Like there's gonna be hard times, but like I said, like I never knew this was an opportunity for me and look where I am now. Like I'm performing at like the highest level. Wait, I need... <laughs> Little Sharpe action. <laughs>